Hey guys, today I have another example of cluster sampling for you. So let's say we wanted to pull, survey students at our school and I didn't want to go into every classroom and pull two students out. That would be stratified sampling and I didn't want to randomly sample all the students and have to go hunt them all down. In um, respect to convenience, what we're able to do is use cluster sampling and it's still a random way um, that can get you some results that you want. So let's talk about the math hall. I'm only going to talk about the math hall's classrooms and I'm going to individually number them because these classrooms are my clusters. So one, two, three, four, five, six. In a random number generator, I would then put one comma six. And let's say I want to pull um, 50 students total to survey. So if I randomly pull out using ran and one comma six, and I want two of my clusters, let's say I get the numbers one and five. So one and five are my chosen clusters. That means the 25 students in classroom one and the 25 students in classroom two are going to join together to make my complete sample of 50. So the purpose behind this is so that I'm not interrupting every single classroom and I'm just taking two whole classrooms and I'm going to take those, all of those students in those two clusters to be a part of my sample.